Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Oblivion. We are currently in the outskirts of Fort Grief, having just escaped all of the huntsmen inside and come out to find the person that we were here to rescue being murdered by the asshole who put us in here. So now we have to go up and talk to him and see what he has to say for himself. I'm impressed that you killed all my clients. Doesn't matter. More will come along with their purses fat with gold and hearts lusting for blood. Unless I chop your balls off and make you Alaric. eat them. Didn't need him anymore now that you're here. At least now he's free of his debt. <laughs> yeah, you murdered him pretty good. Well done. You murdered an unarmed man without any armor. Well done. You're really powerful. Do you really think I could afford to let you leave here? The key you found is a fake. No prey has ever left this island alive. And I aim to keep it that way. You were right about one thing, though. This is my game, and I'm changing the rules. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. He wants to fight. Okay. Uh, let's, let's paralyze him. Immobilize him and fuck him up. He dodged. He dodged. He dodged again. Shit. Let's run and hide up here. Oh shit, there's someone else. There's an archer up here. Fuck me. He brought an archer. I guess that means you can't just hide up here indefinitely. Okay, we're going to have to have an archer fight with this guy. After turning down that uh, bow that I saw. Meanwhile, he's just running around below in, 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 with a hammer and in heavy armor, not able to do anything. That's really funny. Yes, come closer. Die, damn you. Let's summon a zombie to fight. Right, get him, Chuckles. I'll distract him. You fuck him up. Well, that zombie's doing work. Ow. Got him. Right, so that's him dead. So that means this guy can't do anything, right? Because he's just standing around like an idiot down there with armor. Yeah, that's really funny. <laughs> so we just get to archer him down now. If he stands still. Get him, zombie. That one hit the zombie. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, stand there while my archer, while I arch you to death, and my zombie hacks you to pieces. Shit, I fell off. Well, I'm safe here for the moment, so. Let's just keep firing at him. No, I fell off again. I fell off even more, and I'm stuck. Okay, we need to uh, paralyze him or he's going to kill us. Get him, zombie. Mm -hmm. 
Let's go back up here where we're nice and safe. Uh, uh, oh, I almost didn't make it then. Jesus. That was close. Right, get him, zombie. I've returned to find Curden himself standing over the corpse of Alaron, whom he'd murdered. I had no choice but to attack and slay him. I should search Curden's corpse for anything that may help me gather these ruins. Okay, nice. Firstly, let's loot this fucker. Where does bow go? Ebony arrows, I'll take them. Ebony dagger, iron bow, elven stuff, I will take all of it. Uh, we need to use our light and burden or whatever, light and load. Ease burden. He had a bow as well. It should have fallen down. Damn it, it's going to be hard. Oh, no it's not. I was, to, I was just about to say, it's going to be hard to find, but... Right, where did this guy's glass... Ah, uh, there it is. Warhammer of absorption. Iron arrow. Oh, he had light armor. That's a shame. If only he had heavy armor. The key I recovered, I discovered on the Orc Hunter was indeed a fake, and the real key was on Curdan's body. He'd never intended to let us leave, whether we won this demented hunt or not. The real key should allow me to unlock the gate room inside the Hunter's Run and then leave Fort Grief. I will then have to bring you uh, saying that that's sad news. Okay, we are completely overburdened now, so what do we get rid of? Well, firstly, let's repair everything. Because that's experience right there. Lovely. Uh, and then let's drop off the stuff that we don't want. The least expensive stuff. So, oh, we got an ebony bow. Nice. You want all the ebony stuff. I think the elven armor would be the, whoa, Warhammer of Absorption. That's going to be selling for a pretty penny. Boots of the Silt Runner, water walking on self, what garbage, we'll get rid of that, nice. Elven Boots, Elven Curious, Elven Gauntlets, Elven Greaves, Elven Shield, Gauntlets of the Equinox. Okay. So how much are we over by? A hundred, we're over by a hundred, jeez. Okay. Let's drop off on this guy the stuff we definitely don't want, like the Orcish Helmet, the Elven Shield, the Elven Gauntlet, Elven Boots. The, we're going to have to go to the Curiouses, aren't we? And some Elven Greaves. Right, we'll come back and loot in a minute once we've uh, been to town. We'll come back and loot him, and hopefully all the stuff will still be on him. Nice, that was a good quest. We've got a load of good weapons and armor that we can sell for a shit ton of money, and armor that powered us up quite significantly. We're we back in Bru uh, Breville. Yeah, we are. Okay. Greetings to you. Okay, let's wait. It's 9.30 p.m., so we have to wait 12 hours before we can go back in. That means we're probably going to trigger vampirism and not be able to fast travel. Which is a shame, because I want to fast travel back to the island, pick up all that elven stuff I dropped off. Let's check. No, we're good. Okay. Enthralling presence, huh? Well met. How much do you like Take me? Ninety-two. Time. Have a look at my wares. 
Haggle at 68. That should be good. Ebony Bow does 7 damage compared to what? We don't use the bow enough to keep it. She only has 800, so that's really quite low. That's annoying. Oh, well. Let's sell it. Ebony Dagger. We want the long sword. The Ebony Mace can go. Ebony Short Sword can go. Elven Short Sword can go. Warhammer of Absorption. We want to keep basically everything that'll sell for a lot more. We can get an extra 50% by taking it back to the Imperial City. Anything that's under the amount that she's off. Yeah, we can sell. That's fine. Light and load. Oh, I didn't realize I had that. Whatever. Get rid of it. That seems a fair price. Sapphire can go. That seems a fair Right, how are we doing on weight now? 314 still. How is that? Why are we so heavy? Oh, because we're wearing all the armor. And we've got the ebony longsword. And we've still got the Warhammer of Absorption, which is 75 pounds. Jeez. Good day. Um, I think I'll just sell it, whatever. Good day. I know we could get more by going back to the Imperial City, but I'm sure there's something to suit we'll just sell it here. That's a good deal. Because we can get more by going back to the island. Although these are only three pounds, so I'll keep them. Right, let's go back to the island Thank and get all that elvish stuff that we left. Travel to Fort Grief. Okay, we got everything. All the loot we can possibly carry. Can we fast travel from here? Probably not. No, we can't fast travel. So we just have to swim across. We will swim across directly to Bravil from here. Let's go. Let's go, chat. Let's hope nothing monstrous or Lovecrafty and or sea an enemy-ish, <laughs> I don't know, attacks us. Just dragged us under and we never see the light of day again. We made a good bit of gold from that, and we also had a significant power up in the form of the ebony armor. Save it now on land. I'll just check over here for um, oh, Nern Root. There we go. Found some. I'll just kill the mud crab, otherwise, it's going to cause all kinds of problems. Oh. Where is my new sword? Where is the new sword? The ebony long sword. Die! Die very quickly compared to how you used to die. We are so fucking slow now, though, chat. To be honest, I might get rid of the ebony stuff because it's not the highest tier of armor you can get. Daedric is the highest tier of heavy armor you can get. So we're going to get rid of it at some point anyway. And at the moment, it's so heavy, we're so slow that we can no longer outrun enemies. And being able to outrun and kite enemies and regenerate magic... And then, like, hit them with a paralyzed spell or 
you know, whatever else is actually way more useful than, uh, than having a, a subpar set of heavy armor. So I think I'll go back to the Imperial City, sell it all, and pick up another heavy raiment. Why is it? Oh, she must be in the chapel. Something's wrong. I can tell. He died. He when dead. I saw the grave look on he your dead. Face, I knew something had happened to him. Yeah, he got murdered. And what of that fetcher, Curtin? Well, I murdered him in exchange. We murdered each other. That's what happened. Then Alaran's death has been avenged. I told him that the gambling would lead to this, that foolish man. But he never listened. Yeah, he's stupid. Before you go, I have this for you. Alaran told me that if he ever got in trouble, this could be used to bail him out of jail. What is it? He'll not be needing it any longer. And I want you to have it. I'll not take no for an answer. I know you did all you could. And for that, I thank you. Now, please, go in peace. I wish to be alone. Biography of the Wolf Queen. Is that it? Oh, my God. How was that going to smuggle him out of jail? That doesn't sell for shit. What are you talking about, you crazy woman? Speechcraft. Oh, I see. They could use speechcraft to negotiate his freedom or something. I'm Othralos, priest of Mara. I'm also a speech... How are you? And you have magic spells. Only nice. Quality goods for sale here. Greater what convalescence. No, we've got all of these. We've got everything we need from here. I don't each if you yeah, full on watchman. Oh wait, she has rumors. What rumors do you have for me? People are subdued. Oh, okay, no rumors. You see. Oh, we are so slow and tanky now, chat. We're like boom. Boom, boom, boom. Full on Watchman through a Nightmare Darkly. Bravil recommendation. We're going to do that next. I'm just going to fast travel back to the market district and sell everything we're wearing. Oh, it's just 9 29. That's unfortunate. We missed it by an hour. Um, what do we do now? I guess we wait. Yeah, we have to wait until morning. Uh, 11 hours. That's annoying. Our vampirism will go up again, but whatever. C'est la vie. Yeah, I had that dream already. Oh! I am. Kidoki. Good day. How are you in terms of your disposition? Ninety seven. Perhaps you need new armor. A weapon. Fifty five percent. Is that really that low? At ninety seven? Surely it should be higher. Yeah, we're gonna sell that. Elven boots. And that's Elven Curious. Orcish helmet. You got a great deal there. Ebony boots. Curious. That's a good and greaves. And the Orcish gauntlets. Okay. I'm not much faster. Much better chance. Ah. Let's go get another he heavy arraignment. 
heavy arena rainment. Any news? Certainly. Uh, we need to confront Thorin here, don't you we? You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. So we'll go confront Thorin here in a moment. I don't want to tell anyone about it just in case he doesn't know. And then we put him in the shit and then he's like, fuck you and hates us. Motion of insulation. Biography of the Wolf Queen. That's more than I would usually pay. Yeah. We need no. to go back to Wayne and Priory as well. Yes, look at my muscles. Let's heal up while we're indoors. Welcome. I can't believe what I'm seeing in this book. I'm mortified to think these things here were once on the bodies of the recently deceased. Yes. It's just too horrible to comprehend. I don't even know what to say. I, I guess an apology is not enough. What can I do? You can join the... Yeah, help me catch Agamemnon. Yes, that's the least I can do. First... Yes, force, betray your friend. I will never meet with him again. I can promise you that. Secondly, I remember him mentioning a place he had to be this very day. Hmm. Yes, that's right. He said that he wouldn't be able to do anything else as he had something important to do. Okay. You don't think he would dig up another... Oh, no, he wouldn't. But I guess he has been. Oh, my. What have I done? I will stop him. Yes, you do that. And in the meantime, I'll decide what to do with all these ill-gotten things. I'm so sorry. I hope everyone can forgive me for not doing a better job checking up on my sources. Any rumors? I don't know that anyone in Cyrodiil drives a hard... Okay. I hope... oh! Unfriendly competition. Good morning. Right, now this one itself is another one where you go in and you get trapped in. You go into the tomb and they, clock, they lock the door behind you. And they don't let you leave until you've killed them and gotten the key off them. So uh, I'm going to have to do a drop a hard save and see if we're powerful enough to fight them. We might be now, actually. Now that we've got those up, this upgraded sword. And, uh, yeah. I've noticed the door to the Trentius family mausoleum has been unsealed. This might be... Our yeah, I must proceed inside. Drop a hard save in case it over saves, saves over or whatever. We're going to need to immobilize because there's two of them. So we're going to need to immobilize and then summon a zombie. 
I've located Agamir inside the Trentius family mausole mausoleum. It appears as though he's attempting to desecrate another grave along with someone else I don't recognize. I need to convince him to stop this heinous act. I had a feeling you'd catch on sooner or later. That's why I had this trap prepared for you. If you'll notice, the grave is already dug. Oh no, we walked into a trap this chat. This time it wasn't to take something away from the graveyard. It was to add something. I'm afraid all I can offer you is an unmarked grave. Well, all I can offer you is my sword in your face. I missed. I missed. Okay. Yeah, there's two of them. They're fucking powerful. I don't think I'll be able to do this just yet. With the two of them in there. Oh, it's crashed. Yeah, it crashed. Okay. With two of them in there, I don't think I'll be able to defeat them. Because we can't run away. We can't, like, mess around at all. We can't kite them and spawn I might just have to suck down healing potions and mana potions paralyzing them and let the zombie chew them up nope it's completely crashed and bugged that's annoying the hard save outside the tomb Uh-ohs, this doesn't look good, chat. It may have completely fucked up my game. We can't load. Let's try again. Loads, the quick save. Yeah, it's completely bugged the game. Right, let's try another save that was slightly further back than that. If it's fucked up all my saves, chat, then this might be the end of the playthrough. I'm not restarting again. Fuck that. Yeah, I oh know, okay. Okay, so this is that. Can I load this quick save from here? No. Right, chat, my computer might need a restart. That might be what it is. It might be something else, but I'm going to end this, the, the episode here. I'll try loading the save that I have. If I can get the save working, then uh, basically I'm going to try a complete computer restart, shut down, restart, all that lot. I'll then try loading the save that we just had, and if we can't, then I'll have to load from that previous save, play through to where we just were and then save it at that point and carry on but i'll do all of that off stream guys and i will pick up from the point where we're entering the tomb uh in the next episode thank you so much for hanging out today i do hugely appreciate it i hope you're enjoying it i'll be back tomorrow morning with another episode of oblivion hopefully i will see you there for that if not i'll try and catch you in some other content i produce i try and make content every single day now so so wait till next time